It's early morning. And in the primate house, the spider monkey family awakes to an exciting development. Overnight, there's been a new addition. It's another little girl, this time named Laura. When we found out that Chiara had had the baby, I was really excited. I think because we thought she still had a bit longer to go yet um, before you know, she gave birth. Uh, so it was a bit of a, a surprise, really, but a, a great one, obviously. But excitement over the new group member is soon replaced with anxiety about Chiara's parenting approach. She is a first-time mum, and that's always a bit of a concern. We did see signs when she first arrived of a maternal instinct, but obviously you don't know for sure what it's going to be like until they actually have a baby of their own. Her mum died when she was quite young. I think she was a year and a half when her mum died. That could be a problem in itself, as we don't know how experienced or, you know, how much she sort of experienced of being raised or seeing others being raised. The, the, the father isn't involved much at all um, in the early days, if at all. It's kind of left to the mum to, uh, to raise the kids. Kiara seems shell-shocked. Normally, she's really involved in the group, but we've noticed she's sort of keeping to the, you know, outside of the group, keeping sort of hunched over. Looks a little bit tired, but we just have to monitor her behaviour. I like to think she's just, you know, a new mum and in new mum shock. <laughs> At just eight years old, Kiara is barely an adult herself. But if she doesn't step up and start parenting, the baby's life will be at risk. It's been a week since spider monkey mum Kiara gave birth, and the keepers are starting to worry. She seems to miss hanging out with her younger friends in the group. The last couple of days, I've seen her hanging upside down. And um, yeah, we're kind of like, you can't do that anymore. <laughs> You've got motherly responsibilities. She's gone from sort of keeping herself to herself for a couple of days to sort of being like, oh no, I want to go back to my, uh, my normal life of play fighting with the, uh, the younger ones. But um, no, she needs, she needs to go into responsible mum mode. <laughs> Keepers think there could be something wrong with her connection to her baby. We've kind of noticed just recently that the baby's tail's hanging a little bit. The tail looks like it's not wrapped around her, which is it's kind of what you want. Sign. The yeah. first thing, if something, if the first sign of something going wrong yeah, is, is its okay. tail. Spider monkeys have a prehensile tail, like a fifth limb. You'll often see them hanging just from their tail. They're so unbelievably strong, there's so much strength in that tail. When there's babies in the group, they'll wrap their tail often around their mum. So if they stop clinging, it's a vital warning sign. The tail's often the first thing to go because they're losing strength. We've had other baby spider monkeys that survive to about nine, ten days, and they just slowly lose their grip, and then they drop off and it could be an underlying medical condition that it was born with. Or it could be she's not being a good enough mum, that's not getting enough milk. More experienced mum, Chrissy is doing well with her baby. Chrissy's carrying her little in at quite a good height, and Chrissy seems quite comfortable with letting her baby's tail wrap around her own tail, which I think is maybe one of the problems that we're seeing with Kiara. I don't think she likes her baby wrapping her tail around her own tail. Um, so I think that's why we're seeing it hang. I just don't think it's got anything to hang on to. Keepers are helpless to intervene. If we took the baby off her, you know, it wouldn't survive. Um, and it would it would just be so traumatic for her as well. We just don't want to put, put her through that. All the keepers can do is hope the baby pulls through the important coming days. I guess we're maybe being extra cautious because we know it's her first one. We know Chrissy's a pro, whereas Kiara, this is already new for her. Um, 
So yeah, uh, it's something that we're, we're watching really closely. It's been two months since spider monkeys Chrissy and Kiara gave birth. Both babies are doing great. Coming on leaps and bounds, they're looking so alert and they're looking like proper little monkeys now, not really alien-y anymore. Kiara has been slow to adjust to motherhood. I think at first we were maybe all a bit paranoid because we were worried the baby wasn't gripping that well, but I think it was just that she didn't really know how to carry it. Um, you know, it's something new that's clinging onto her really tight. Um, and I think she was just trying to figure out, you know, what was the best way to move around with it and what it was. But Kiara is finally starting to take advantage of being part of a family. She's buddied up with fellow mum Chrissy to share the burden. They seem to be spending a lot of time together, Chrissy and Kiara. It's like a little mum's club or something. She definitely seems to be learning from Chrissy. She's got it in her. She's a she's a good mum, and I think she was naturally going to be a good mum. 